Hello everyone, Athena Artiste here with a fix for getting the latest version of Colonial Charter Journey to work with Banished and the Megamod. It starts over here in the Steam client. Now I do not I did not buy my copy of Banished through good old games, so I really don't know how to opt in for betas through uh, services like good old games or others that have sold banished but in steam to do so you click right click on where banished is in your library go to properties and then go to bot betas and make sure that you have opted in for this beta so that's step one my apologies for my voice. Next step in the process is, of course, to download the latest version of Journey, which is 1.7, from the Black Liquid website. Now, keep in mind that this is going to download as a RAR archive. So you will need to use a program such as 7-Zip, to extract it. There are free versions of this for both versions of uh, the 32-bit and the 64-bit of Windows and it will do a fine job of extracting those files for you. Next step in our process is inside Banished itself. Do check when you get it loaded that you are seeing that it is the one, whatever it is, the beta down here. I'm showing you a blow up of that number down there. Do check while you're here at the first screen to make sure that your load order for your mods has not been changed. In particular, make sure that your compatibility mod is there up above the 1.75 of Journey, and of course the Mega Mod is down below that, along with the Deco Pack. Now, this is where I think I was making one of my big mistakes. So, if you remember that whenever you do a change of mods and so forth, you always have to exit and you have to do the change in your mod order exit from banished and then reload it so that they will work fine well what I think was the important step I forgot to do was first let's go in here and we're going to load my last saved game file for the mega mod now I will get a warning that this mod is different from when the game was saved which is fine because we do know that we did that and I'm not going to cover how to go about copying the PKM file over into uh, where Banished is because I think that's been covered quite well in a number of other sources so we're just going to say yes here at this point now it is going to load our save game Okay, here we are inside the saved game, and you'll notice, yes, we have a much different looking display over here, which I'll get into more in my actual video for the series, but this is what the mistake was that I think I, where I made, is what you need to do at this point now is exit the game, save that fi game file yet again, with now you having approved that it being loaded with that new version of Colonial Charter Journey and now we're going to have to exit from Banished and reload the game and then everything is going to be fine they will be quite happy together so that was my big mistake <laughs> and I apologize to everyone for not catching that sooner <laughs> so see you in the next game bye